the kids are growing up and Gomez is realizing that they are starting to want to pull away from the family unit and find their own way in the world. Gomez, of course, you know, his first reaction is to want to pull them back in and hold them close. So he decides that the best way to do that is to stick everyone in the family camper and go on a road trip. While we're out on this road trip, though, we find out that uh, there might have been a mix-up at the hospital when Wednesday was an infant, and she might have been sent home with them, uh, and uh, the other baby might have been sent home, which was actually theirs, might have been sent home with someone else. So along this road trip, they're also trying to figure out if Wednesday is actually an Adams or if she is a Strange, which is our villain of the movie. Everyone's family has a weirdness to it. Everyone's family has a kook in it. Everyone's family, you know, uh, has their own specific way of, of, of behaving behind closed doors. And I think when you look at the Adams family, the, the most odd family that you've ever seen, you, you're going to find at least pieces in there that you can relate to and say, oh, yeah, that's, that's a lot like my family, too. And, you know, above all the, or beneath all the, the ooky kooky spookiness of the family, you know, they're still a loving family. Cousin It, well, that's uh, played by Snoop Dogg. And what we did on the first movie with him is we figured to get that, that, um, that nonsense, you know, garble that he speaks, we just took Snoop's lines and we reversed them and sped them up. Um, and, uh, and the stuff that we thought we were going to record, which were rhymes, didn't turn out correctly because they were too, they had a meter to them. So it didn't sound just like gerbil. It just sounded like ba da ba ba da ba ba da ba ba It was, it was too metered. So they actually took, uh, some dialogue <laughs> from Snoop and I talking about the Lakers and they just reversed that and sped it up and we used that. This time around we wanted to write him some lines so the lines that he has are actually funny lines that have to do with the story and we recorded those and sped them up and played them backwards as kind of like an Easter egg for people to, to kind of go in and, and see what he actually says if they want to.